TFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials down 77, NASDAQ's off 14, S&P's are down 3, gold. Gold contract caught a bid, up 760, 1349, silver up 20 cents, $16.67. If you take a look at the uh, GDX, HUI, XAU, all up. We got the uh, GDX trading at uh, $23. Uh, bottom line, uh, 23.15 is your swing point from the 14th of uh, February. Uh, bottom line, you're building some cars to get into that area. Uh, notes and bonds, 10-year note up three ticks, uh, trading at 120.17. 30-year bond up seven ticks, 145.19. Uh, King dollar, King dollar down 26 ticks, trading 89.430. If we go over and we take a look at King dollar, what you're going to see with King dollar out here, folks, is that uh, it hasn't been able to hold price, nor volume. Once again, bottom line, King dollar wants to go after the lower end of this consolidation. We go take a look at the S&P, what you have with the S&P, as well as the NASDAQ, and the Dow Industrials, they're all giving it up on price and volume. Uh, and it looks like on a weekly basis, what we're going to have here inside the S&P, the SPY, that is, is that if we get a weekly close under 266.64, that's going to be a failure on price and volume. Right now, you're at 265.74. If we take a look at the NDX 100, the three Qs, we do the same type of uh, set up here, what you're going to see in the NDX 100, uh, we are trading at 162. Uh, if you close under 161.58, it would be a failure on price, failure on volume. If you close up above that, guess what? You can go up and test these uh, highs of this week once again, which is the 163.56. If we actually go over to the composite and take a look at the composite, uh, composite out here also uh, is only down $12. The composite would have to pull back quite a bit uh, to get uh, a failure going because what the composite is doing, as well as the other indices, is that they are coming into the downdraft from the... 23rd of March as well as the 5th of February. That's where this resistance is happening uh, in all the indices right now. To recap here, folks, what we have is this. You have the Dow Industrials down 77. You get the NASDAQ off 14. S&Ps are off 3. We take a look at some of the higher volume stocks out here. And uh, the biggest volume stock out here is uh, Micron Tech uh, Advanced and Advanced Micro. Stay right there, folks. A lot of great programming coming up at TFNN. Have a great one. Have a safe one.